Hello everyone, I'm Seth with Exotic Motorsports and this is our 2014 Ford Mustang Roush Stage 3 with 31,778 miles on it. This car absolutely does not reflect its year or miles. It looks really, really nice in person. The gray and yellow is such a good color combo. It does have one small issue there. And there's a few very small marks in the paint across the front bumper. They're not quite rock chips, not really sure what they are, but there's a few very, very tiny imperfections. But for the vast majority of the front end, it looks really, really good. Very small rock chip there. And I mean, I'm getting into like the smallest, smallest little details. Most people probably won't even see small blemish there. Small rock chip there. But these are the most tiny, insignificant uh, issues. Uh, the front end looks great, honestly. Uh, front driver's side fender here. It's got the uh, yellow vinyl with the RS3 badging on the side. Roush Stage 3. Driver's side front fender looks great. Beautiful five spoke wheels. No imperfections. Great to match the paint. Here on the driver's side mirror, we do have a little bit of uh, chipping here on the middle of the mirror. And then a little bit of scuffing here on the outside, but nothing serious. It doesn't really stand out. Here on the door handle, we have a little bit of scratching. And here on the door, we've got a little bit of scuffing as well, scratching, scuffing. Overall, the door looks really good. It does just have that one tiny little problem spot. Driver's side rear quarter panel looks fantastic. No issues there. Rear driver's side wheel, no issues there. Looks good. Moving along to the back. Looking at the back bumper here. Lower portion of the back bumper Looks really good. Exhaust tips are nice and clean. Tail lights look great. Do have that small blemish there, which I tried to get off with my fingernail, but it's stuck on there. Small chip right there. Top of the trunk lid looks good. Rear wing looks good. Passenger side rear quarter panel. Excuse me. Uh, no flaws there. That all looks really good. Rear passenger wheel. Got a little bit of rash down here. Overall, it's in good shape. Passenger side door. Very clean. No issues. Passenger mirror. Tiny bit of scuffing there just on the outside, but the face of the mirror looks really good. Driver's side, or I'm sorry, passenger side front fender. Got no issues there. And the front passenger wheel. Got no defects, no scratching, scuffing, nothing like that. Wheel looks great. So I will go ahead and walk around the vehicle from a one foot distance to give you a better big picture idea of the overall condition of the car. Here at Exotic Motorsports, we do these comprehensive walk around videos to give our out-of-state buyers the confidence and peace of mind they need to purchase a vehicle from us, sight unseen, if they choose to do so. Walking around a vehicle from a one-foot distance is a lot more indicative of what you might notice on a day-to-day -day basis if you were to own the vehicle yourself and help separate the bigger, more obvious flaws from these smaller, less noticeable ones, giving you kind of a better understanding of the condition of the vehicle. It's easy to make it sound like it's worse than it really is by pointing out every defect that it has but we, do, we believe in uh, complete transparency and full disclosure. So let's go ahead and move to the interior. Beautiful black leather. It does have the shaker audio option. However, I don't believe it's the 500 or the 1000 because it does not have the subwoofer in the trunk. We do have manual leather Recaro seats. These are not power seats, no heating, no cooling. 
I do have beautiful white contrast stitching though, and they're very comfortable. Lots of bolster there to hold you in the seat. Toilet sensing headlights, power adjustable mirrors, power locks, one touch up and down windows for driver and passenger. Six speed manual. It's got single zone climate control. Does have Bluetooth audio, which I mean it's 2021, you gotta have that, right? Push the clutch in, starts right up. The shifter is very firm, it's very pronounced when it goes into gear. You'll never wonder if you're in gear or not. Roush Stage 3 badging right there, traction control hazards and trunk release. Got all of your HVAC controls down here at the bottom, all of your media controls here in the center. This has all kinds of gauge options. Go into gauge mode. There's all kinds of different things to look at. Cylinder head temp, inlet air temp, oil pressure, voltage, AFR, all kinds of good data. We do have a very nice illuminated boost gauge here on the left in the in the vent. Looks really nice, definitely looks like it belongs there. Do have blind spot mirrors as well, very nice to have. Universal garage door remote there, so you can sync that up with your garage door opener and control that with those buttons. Do still have the factory floor plastics in it. And here on the odometer, we're reading 31,798 miles. Passenger seat looks great as well. They both look brand new, no wear whatsoever. All of the uh, interior upholstery looks perfect. Dash looks great. Headliner is in really good shape. I don't see any issues with the headliner, no tears, no sagging, nothing like that. None of the buttons have any wear on them. Steering wheel, uh, kind of an Alcantara steering wheel. I, I do believe it's Alcantara. It's just a, a slightly different kind that I'm used to. Um, but there's no wear on that <laughs> at all either. All the buttons look good. Go ahead and hop out and show you the back seats because I can't quite properly show you them while I'm in the car. Um, does have a very nice kind of uh, release there for the seat to help you fold it forward. Back seats look great. No wear on the back seats at all. And keep in mind, if there's any of this stuff that you'd rather take a closer second look at, we do have a comprehensive photo listing on our website. Link in the description. I average about 50 to 60 photos a car, so I do my best to cover every square inch so you can have a proper look at anything you may have questions about. That hood latch in there is a little tricky. So here's our supercharged V8, making a very healthy amount of power. <laughs> uh, the torque curve on this car is very sharp. Uh, it's very aggressive. It is very fun to drive, uh, especially with it being a manual transmission. It sounds very, very healthy. The shifting the gears feels great. It goes into gear very easily and very deliberately. Transmission feels solid. The engine feels very healthy. And the exhaust note on this car is phenomenal. This car sounds so good. I'll go ahead and blip the throttle for you a bit. So hopefully you can give it a listen, but oh man, this car sounds good. All kinds of pops and gurgles and burbles and just, this car has a lot of personality, especially when you're driving it around under load. The exhaust is pretty loud, but it's not ear splitting. It's not raspy. It has a very smooth, well-rounded sound to it. The exhaust design on this car is perfect. It gives you that really nice American V8 sound without being obnoxious about it. This is just an absolutely beautiful car. That is our 2014 Ford Mustang Roush Stage 3. If you have any further questions, please feel free to check out the sales listing on our website at exoticmotorsportsok.com. Thank you for watching.